Good morning, boys and girls. This is Mr. Rodriguez. Welcome to Pre-K 102 again. It is a wonderful day. Let's begin with our salutation, shall we? Look through my window and who do I see? Marco, Sofia, and Jared looking at me. Hello, hello. Hello and how are you? I'm fine, I'm fine, and I hope that you are too. Look through my window and who do I see? Me, Yanni, Amir, and Valeria looking at me. Hello, hello, hello and how are you? I'm fine, I'm fine. And I hope that you are too. Look through my window and who do I see? Jay's, Kaylin, and Christian looking at me. Hello, 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 and how are you? I'm fine, I'm fine. And I hope that you are too. Look through my window and who do I see? Brittany, Jason, and Jazara looking at me hello 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 and how are you i'm fine i'm fine and i hope that you are too look through my window and who do i see nakai ruth and jacob looking at me hello 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 and how are you i'm fine i'm fine and I hope that you are too. Look through my window and who do I see? La Targe and Ashley and Nicholas looking at me. Hello, hello, hello and how are you? I'm fine, I'm fine. And I hope that you are too. There are seven days, there are seven days, there are seven days in the week. Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. There are seven days, there are seven days, there are seven days in the week. Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. What month are we in? April. April, April, and April begins with the letter A. A has two sounds. What sounds does an A make? A and A, A, A. In this word, April, it has an A sound. The last letter in April is what? L. What sound does L make? Ooh, ooh. And April has a P and an R right here in the middle. What sound does this make? Pr, pr, pr. Very good. Shall we count? Let's count. Ready? I want to hear you. One two, louder, three, four, five, six, can't hear you, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, today is what? Fourteen, today is what? Fourteen, we're using purple for today's pattern on colors in the calendar. 14 has two digits. What's the first digit you write for 14? A one. Down you run and one is done. Ready? Down you run and one is done. And what about the next digit? What is it? If I say 14, the first Part of the word tells me what number it is. Four. Very good. Four. Ready for four? Down and across and down once more. That's the way to make a four. Ready? Down and across 
and down once more. That's the way to make a four. And today is Tuesday, April 14th, 2020. Say it with me. Today is Tuesday, April 14th, 2020. April, April is month four. I'm so glad it's spring once more. I heard it sung that April showers always bring such pretty flowers. April is the month in spring when the birds begin to sing. April, April is month four. I'm so glad it's spring once more. I heard it sung that April showers always bring such pretty flowers. April is the month in spring when the birds begin to sing. And let's sing. And what's the weather? What's the weather? What can it be? What can it be? Does anybody know? Does anybody know? What can it be? What can it be? What's the weather outside? Well, yesterday it was raining. Yes. Did you get scared? Were you worried? It's gone by now. I hope. Look outside. What's the weather outside? Yes, I have my little dog friend here and my spring background. It's what? Cloudy. We're going to put the sun right behind it because this afternoon it's going to be shining some sun either in the morning or in the afternoon. But we have a partly cloudy day. So let's say partly cloudy. Say it again. Partly cloudy. That means it's half cloudy, half sunny. Now, if we were to go outside, we need to wear our pants or jeans. We would wear a shirt. Yes. But you have to wear a sweater or a jacket. Because it's not going to get warmer, it's going to get colder. So if it does get colder, you have to get yourself a little bit more warmer on the outfit. So you don't get cold when you go outside. You should wear a cap. We're still using our cute little outfit. And I would, just in case, carry an umbrella. Just in case. You don't know. It's partly cloudy. That doesn't mean it's going to rain. But I don't know. Things can change. All right? So it is partly cloudy and cold. What is it? Partly cloudy and cold. You have been with me this week. It will be a month. As a matter of fact, it'll turn the month exactly tomorrow. Tomorrow, Wednesday. But we've been doing this foundations for almost more than a month. I just had to bring it back and make sure you had it at home to practice on it. So my wish is that you are able to do this foundations letter and sound formation with me so that I can test you. And the only way that I can do that is that you record with your mom and dad how you do this. You have to have this chart with you. You are not allowed to do this without it. So those kids who are doing it without it, please stop doing that. That's memorization. Show me that you can do it with this chart and have mommy or daddy record you so that I can hear you and I know what you're pointing at. Repeat after me. Ready? A, apple, a. B, bat, b. 
C cat k D dog d E ed e F fun f G gang H hat I itch i J jug j K kike L lamp l M man m and not n O octopus a P pan Q U Queen Qua R Rat Er S Snakes T Topped U Up A uh. V Van V W Win W X Fox X Y yellow y yeah. Z zebra z Please practice it, record it, and let me know how it went. So we're doing our rhyming words, and this is today's rhyming. We're doing dig and pig. So pig is on the bottom, dig is on the ice cream in blue. Dig. So when you dig, you use a shovel and you pull out dirt and you're digging a hole. So dig is the first one, dig. What rhymes with it is an animal. That animal lives in the farm and makes an oink oink sound and his name is a pig, pig. So let's say dig pig. What rhymes with dig and pig? I'll give you an example. It has something to do with this. Big. Big rhymes with dig pig. So big. The other one has to do with something you eat. And this, it's what it's called, fig. I've never seen you eat one, but have you eaten a fig? If you've not, try it. It doesn't taste bad, it tastes good. So we have dig, pig, big, fig. Let's do the last one. This one. Sometimes people wear this on their head. It's called a wig. Say wig. So you have dig, rhymes with pig, rhymes with big, rhymes with fig, rhymes with wig. And so those are the words that we're rhyming. We want you to do some rhyming words this week. Pick any word that you know you can rhyme. Use something like this. Maybe you'll find them somewhere else. But do your best because you are smart and I want you to get better. See you in the next video on Read Aloud and Math. Bye.